Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back. That's right, the frame has changed. And that means the game has changed, too. Maybe. 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 There we go. What a delightful little chime to start the hell that's going to be Mike Tyson's punch out. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to my walking nightmare. I love this game so much. I, this, as, as spoken about earlier, was literally one of my first games. Growing up, whenever I had a free minute, it was spent punching Glass Joe in the face. Over and over and over again. I love it. I will never not love this process of coming down the pipe, watching Glass Joe get ready, and then, oof, 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 oh, he's gonna block. One, two, three, and wait for him to reset his hands, and one, two, three, wait for it, and one, two, three. I can sit here and keep doing this the whole fucking round, until he takes a step back and punch in the stomach. Oh, son of a bitch. I was a little bit too late on that punch in the stomach, or else that would've been a one-hit KO there. And yes, that is, in fact, Mario, Little Duck. Uh, one of his other jobs, besides being a plumber and also a doctor and also... is to, in fact, be a referee. Uh, another little note here. Whenever you see a fighter get up at one, that's a very dangerous thing for them to do. Because when they get up at one, if you are able to acquire a star... one uppercut puts them right square back on the floor. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is a TKO for Glass Joe. <laughs> and that's basically how these first couple of rounds are gonna go. Like, seriously, give me your goddamn lunch money, Glass Joe, because I'm not taking any prisoners this time. Von Kaiser, you're Von Fuckhead. <sighs> Come on, military man. I'm gonna clean your clock. Bye, Jackson. Thank you so much for dropping by. We'll see you later on. You can actually kind of abuse this system too. Uh, if you want to, you can punch him right when he starts to wiggle his head and he flashes. And you get a star that way. And you can knock him out there. <laughs> I'm serious, like, I know this game way too well. And then when he starts doing uh, his, his, his uppercuts, you can punch him in the stomach there. For another uppercut. Hi, Green. Welcome. You came in a good time, my friend. And punch. Give me that star. Oh, God. Oh, you almost got me there, didn't you, you son of a bitch? And with one star remaining, that's two TKOs, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, a minute and three seconds. That's probably a record for me. Next challenge. The Minor Circuit Title Battle. We're already in a title bout, ladies and gentlemen. We've been playing this game for less than five fucking minutes. <laughs> oh. From Tokyo, Japan. Piston Honda. Oh, shut up, shut up, phone. Shut up, phone. Phone. I loaded up my own damn Twitch on my phone, and then when I turned off my phone, I guess it immediately loaded back up. Oh, God. Ow. And so when I turned to open my phone to check what time it was, well, guess what loaded up? God damn it. I keep trying to do the, okay, so when you dodge, you can actually press the up button very quickly after you dodge. Wait for it. Oh fuck, oh fuck. That was supposed to knock him out, not just give me a star. Damn it. Um, you can actually press the up button very quickly after you do a dodge. Wait for it. To swing back in quickly uh, into place so you can counter punch a lot faster than you otherwise could. Damn it. He should have already been down by once right now. Uh, yes, Green. That is one of Piston Honda's tells. When he wiggles his eyebrows, he's going to do a straight jab. And you have to block and you get two counter punches. One, two. When he does the hook, you get, I think, five, three, four, five. Yep. Another hook. Oh, uppercut. Damn it. And we're down. Son of a bitch! And that's why he's the champ. Wait for it. Up. Uh, uh, uh. Nope. Oh, we fucked that one up royally. 
Wait for it. Ah, uh, there we go. That's what's what, what was supposed to happen the first time. Uh, one day, little duck, one day I will have my own emotes, and that'll be a fun day. Can I? Ah, oh, fuck! I was hoping that I would be able to sneak in with an uppercut at the last second, and possibly, uh, uh, snake out the third KO there for the TKO, but I wasn't able to do it. Oh well, it's fine. Guess what? Whee! I can take him down in the third round. Ah, oh, goddammit! I can't do the quick return. I keep forgetting that. You can only use the quick return in, well, really, at the beginning of the next stage when you fight Don Flamenco. But you'll see. You'll see how that one works. <laughs> oh, you guys and your damned emotes. I, one day, you guys, I will actually have full use of, like, the subscriber function and have my own emotes and be a turbo member and et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Et cetera. Partner, yada yada yada. But I don't mind. I enjoy sitting here with you guys. Playing games that I love. Oh, this is the best. I can't believe I'm getting to sit here and play Mike Tyson's Punch Out for you guys. Piston Honda, you can't get me down. Not with your silly little punches. Oh god. Wait for it. Wham! Ah, TKO. Second round TKO, but whatever. I'll take it. That's three TKOs in a row. Oh, really? Is that right, Harwood? I did not know that. Oh, is that right, Frisco? I, uh, I totally forgot. Uh, I will do that in a minute. <laughs> Gotta get ready to write down the passcode. Just in case we encounter another glitch like we did at Mega Man and I have to restart. Or, God forbid, when we get to Mike Tyson and I get my ass destroyed, I'll have to have the second passcode to start back from, Jesus, the end of the dream circuit. Okay. Oh, that's right. There is a passcode straight to the Mike Tyson fight. I forgot about that. 737 5, 4, 2, 3. Also, I could just take a picture of it, but I don't care that much. I know, Kisty. I remembered. Okay, this is my favorite fight because this is where that quick return comes in really handy. If you get it just right. Damn it. You can actually sit here and go left, right, 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 until he falls. It's actually kind of cheap. The only, the only time when he actually attacks first is right when he comes up. And then he goes down again. Oh, Don Flamenco, how like a Spanish lover. So willing to go down. Oh, and that's a knockout, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> yes, Green, Mario is in fact the referee. I'll tell you this, I'm hoping at one point or another I'll be able to play the Wii version of Punch-Out because that game, that game is fucking great. Like seriously fucking great. If you ever played this original version of Punch-Out, you need to get that Wii version because it was made so well and captures everything that was great about this game and improves on it a hundredfold. Uh, you get a bunch of great enemies that were either in the sequel uh, that was on the Super Nintendo or our original, as well as a bunch of the original characters as well. So the, round, the rounds are a lot longer. I think it's like four rounds of five people instead of three rounds of, of like three, four, and five. Um, and much less repeats, uh, as well as the fact that you have the championship round afterwards where they actually alter the mechanics of the fights. They, they change the weaknesses of the characters around and make them fight differently and make you learn a brand new attack pattern. Like, it feels fresh and new again. It feels really awesome. Fucking King Hippo comes out, and instead of having his belly exposed like normal, he has a manhole cover in front of his belly. And you have to figure out how to knock off said manhole cover. It's actually... 
Easy once you figure out how. Difficult to figure out how. To get that manhole cover off. And once you get the manhole cover off, you're free to just wail on his belly again as per usual. But it's really cool that they kind of are not only aware of the weaknesses, but play off of them and change them up and make the characters feel like, you know, characters are making real decisions. Come on. Give me that. Knockout. Ah, oh, fuck. <sighs> I was just two hits shy. I, I, I always mis misgauge how much damage that star is going to do. Um, the original, well, this game, the original, does something that the punch out on the Wii doesn't do in that punch out on the Wii, when you use a star, it actually does a more powerful blow and takes up all of your stars at once. The more stars that you have, up to a max of three, and then I think it does like almost a full bar of damage. It's kind of ridiculous. But then um, you're able to, if you're able to stack up those stars, you can knock somebody out very quickly. <laughs> and so, I was trying to figure out how to preface the fact that there are now magic powers in this game. T TKO. Um, the Great Tiger has a special ability. And he uses it to a uh, minimal effect against me. Because you block each of those punches, and then at the end of it, he is completely vulnerable to a one-hit knockout. And now we're on to the title bout against Bald Bull! Bald Bull from Istanbul! But it's cool because Great Tiger is from India and people from India have mystic powers, right? That's a thing. Ah. Now Bald Bull is a little, this is where they actually start getting difficult and it's no longer about like, cheating their patterns and it's about following their patterns because they start going too fast come on there we go like for those first couple of rounds I can sit there and jab glass Joe and von Kaiser in the face when they're about to attack get a star and knock them down pretty quickly but here uh, the timing is a lot more precise and tricky, and I haven't really learned it, and I don't really care to because, well, I can still knock him out this way. Here in just a second. Oh, God. Hopefully, I can knock him out a second time before he does his signature move. Uh. Nice. All right. So when he gets up sometime in this last minute, he is going to do his bull charge. Bull charge is fucking terrifying. Huh. But it also gives me a one-hit KO opportunity, unlike anything else that he throws at me. Uh. Uh, his timings are so peculiar. Here we go. Bull charge. Boom! Gotcha, bitch! TKO! Woo! With the low jab from downtown. Uh. Double up. Uh, uh. That's how you take down a bull, ladies and gentlemen. You stare him in the horns, and you punch him in the gut. Now we're at night, and we're running. I love his pink sweatsuit. That's always been my favorite little piece of garb that he has. <laughs> But the Statue of Liberty at night is very pretty, isn't it? <laughs> Apparently, they trimmed every single wrinkle with lights that night. All right. And now it's time for the World Circuit. Here we get a couple of rematches. Six more fights on our path. At the end of it is the dream fight. Mike Tyson, baby. Do, 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 do. So Piston Honda is back. He's got a couple of new moves up his sleeves. He will actually throw a couple of jabs this time instead of just one. And his uppercuts come at a much quicker pace. And then he has that one. But at the end of that move, you actually get a couple of good, uh, you get the chance to get a couple of good hits on him. Damn it. Uh. Oh God, oh God. 
And I assume that that is no longer just a TKO. I forget. There is one enemy. I think it might be in the new game. God damn it. He hits like a hammer. Ooh. That had no tell in it, did it? Wow, that hurt a lot. And also there was no way I was gonna be able to block all those punches either, ooh. actually having to concentrate on this one. Wait for it. Uh. Nope. One, two, three, four. Ah, oh, son of a bitch! I almost got him down. All right. Uh, another little secret. Inside of every round, uh, whenever you get to these little round breaks, you can sit here and mash on the select key like I'm doing right now. And if you notice, Doc is actually just slamming on Mac's shoulder hard, just whamming on it. And somehow, that actually gives me back a little bit of help. <sighs> so, now I actually stand a fighting chance again against Piston Honda. Two, three, uh, got him. Snuck in there for a star. Excellent. But anyway, I think it might be the second bald bull fight. Uh, you can't actually KO him by normal means. You have to KO him either in his bull strike or with a star. Uh, uh, uh. Yes. One, two, three, four. Wait for it. One, two, three, and uppercut. Oh, fuck. Not enough damage. Got one. Got one. Oh, fuck. Ooh. Oh. Oh. I, count, I only counted four blows, but he was still vulnerable. Okay, that's one KO. Uh, Frisco, I, here's the thing. How racist is a game that makes fun of everyone? I mean, personally, I think it's not. You know, once, once you get to the point where everyone is still represented, just, you know, in maybe stereotypical format. You're, you're, you're kind of at that point of parody and or satire and or having fun that you can't really get upset at. You know what I mean? Ah, fuck me! Ah. This one might actually go into decision. He's got me fucked up. But I don't think he's K, I don't think he's knocked me down yet. No, he, had, he did, he knocked me down in the first round. Shit, so we're one and one. This is not good, you guys. I might lose this one by decision. How embarrassing would that be? All right, wait for it. One, two, three, sneak back in. Nope, didn't get it. Whew. The timing on those uppercuts is so weird. Oh, 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 oh. That's two knockouts. Okay. Oh, is he gonna stay down? Nine, get up, stay down. 10, third round KO, baby, woohoo! It may not be the ideal way to take somebody down, but you know what? When we're in the world circuit, I will fucking take it. Oh. Next up, Soda Popinski. One of my favorite and drunkest. Yep, three he is down. Um, well, Kisty, in order to guarantee a TKO, you have to knock him down three times in one round. Um, once you get to the last round, it's kind of a, a much greater opportunity for him to do that sort of very suspenseful, like, up at five. Oh, he's down again. Oh, he gets up at nine. Oh, he's still down. Kind of action. Um, where you just get a regular old KO. But anyway, Soto Popinski. Uh, incidentally enough, little little quick tip about this character. In the original arcade version, he was actually uh, drinking a bottle of vodka, being from Russia, and known as... Oh, excuse me. Known as uh, uh, Vodka Drunk. God, it's Coke. Vodka Drunkinski, I believe. And much like in the updated version, you can actually see him drinking a bottle at various points. By updated version, I mean the Wii version. Oh, bu -bu -bu -bu. He's actually one of the few Southpaws. You'll notice that he jabs with his left and uppercuts with his right. Is 
So that makes him especially tricky to dodge because you're having to look on the opposite side of most of the fighters. And of course he comes dancing right back in. Also, he has the most annoying death taunt ever. Like if he kills you, you feel like, you haven't felt like that much shit since the dog and fucking duck hunt. One, two, three, and I'm back. Oh uh, fuck. Uh, huh, huh, huh. Um, if you lose all of your stars by getting hit or blocking damage, you have to regain them by dodging attacks. And then you regain some of your hearts back. Uh, a lot of the challenge that's presented in a round is determined by how many hearts they give you. Uh, if you remember back in the... <sighs> shit. Back in the Great Tiger Fight, it actually gave me a bunch of hearts. Uh, which usually means that you're gonna want to block a bunch of attacks. Fuck! Immediately with the knockdown. <laughs> See, you hear, you hear that obnoxious ass fucking laugh every time you get knocked down with that shit. One, two, three, back in. One, two, three. Oh, God. Oh, he's so scary. Oh, he's so scary. The uh, time in between him going down for an uppercut and coming back up is ridiculous. Fuck. Ah. Oh, God damn it. Ah. Fuck you, Soda Popinski! And then he just laughs right in my face. I choked. I choked hard. I choked hard, you guys. Don't cry, Mac! You can try again! Ugh. Like I said, this is where the game actually starts getting really hard. And you, you really have to play the game. It has nothing to do with being like, okay, this is the pattern. Fuck! Soda Popinski, why you gotta touch me inappropriately? You know I don't like that. One, two, three, four. One. Oh, nice. Somehow snuck out a fucking star. I'll, I'll take my lucky stars on that one. Oh, fuck me! Good night, Eevee. Thank you so much for hanging out. You're the best. And knockout. Good. So we're one for one. We are one for one on the knockout scale. <laughs> All right. Come on, you jello leg son of a bitch. Ha! Oh, he. Ha! Ha! There we go. The timing on his uppercuts is a lot different than most other people. Because not only is it a longer time in between attacks, so you're sitting there kind of anticipating a little bit, and you end up basically dodging right before he does the attack that kills you. Also, I'm pretty sure the noise that he makes when he does his little foot shuffle is the sound that it makes when you die in Mario. I'm not sure, but I believe that's the case. Also, how's my health? I think it's terrible. So I'm gonna go ahead and heal myself here. Yep, it's terrible. All right. That healing is here and will go away in like two hits. So we got to be careful. Because we're in round two now where point values are doubled. <laughs> Including those punches to the face, baby. Yeah. Incidentally, you'll notice that you actually do regain just a little bit of health every time you attack. Uh, when you, well, when your health is low anyway. And so does your opponent. So, ugh, fuck me! Getting hit, fuck! Getting hit can not only be a bad thing for you because you get hit back. Come on! But you also, fuck me! You also heal them just a little bit. No! 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 Oh no, you motherfucking cock sucking vodka drinking son of a pink bitch! Oh, when did Kirby go to the fucking gym? That's what I want to know. I'm back at goddamn Piston fucking Honda. Oh. I'm 
so mad. So mad right now, you guys. So mad. Can't even take how mad I am right now. One, two, three. I'm gonna take it out on you, Piston Honda. Just all on you. Oh, God. Two, three. I agree, Kisty. More talk, less talking, more punching. But I also have to entertain, and I'm not here with anybody else. It's just me. No fucking way. No fucking way. After how much shit he gave me the first time around, I just one hit KO'd him. So mad. I'm so mad right now. All right, God damn it. You and me, buddy. I'm gonna take those orange trunks and shove them so far down your fucking throat that you'll be shitting them out for a week. As he says, immediately getting hit in the face. Oh. Yeah. Gotcha now, fucker. What are you thinking? Huh. You may be from Soviet Russia, but in America, Glove punches you! Hey Ow. God damn it. Uh, dodge that one. One, two, three. Woo! Woo! Damn it! Wait for it. I almost got hit on that one. You see that shit? Like, I'm having to very carefully time myself. Like, purposefully make myself wait. Oh, thought they were gonna give that one to me. Wait for it. Nope. Oh, that was so close. That was so close. I oh, I felt my fingers flash before my eyes on that one. And oh, we're so close to the end of the round. Oh fuck! No! 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 Yes, saved by the bell. Stick and move, Mac. Stick and move. Okay, we're gonna pop our health back up just a little bit because Jesus, we are so low. Nine and two, baby. Regain that health just a little bit. Loosen up the fingers. All right, so to Popinski. Once you pop, I can't stop. Oh, no, no. Ah, got him. Fuck you. One KO down, two more to go. I think if you get five total spread across all rounds, or three in one round, uh, it, it will KO them. Like, they will lose. So you can get two in the first round, two in the second round, and then one in the third, and that will count as a KO. And that's like the most that it could possibly take. No, you don't. Not this time, you big pink mustachioed fucker. Woo! 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 Hiya! That's right. You lay there and flash your gooch to all the men and women in the audience. Alright. Uh, we gotta dodge, and we're gonna be able to get in a good couple of hits here. Fuck! Oh, fuck. No! No, this is not going to happen. Not today. God damn it. TKO. No! No! So mad right now, you guys. So mad. So mad. That takes us all the way back. <laughs> oh, son of a bitch! No. Okay.
There we go. Oh, let's do this again. Don't worry, ladies and gentlemen. We are at least going to get to Mike Tyson. We might not beat him. I don't know. I'll keep beating my head against that goddamn brick wall until it bleeds. But um, we're going to get there. I am not going to be beaten by Soda Pop fucking Inski. Not going to happen. Not going to happen. Wait for it. Two, three. Hey, yeah. God damn it. Curiosity begs the question whether I can sneak in. God damn it. A, uh, a quick snipe in in the belly when he's down there for the uppercut, but I really don't want to try it. He really hasn't done any of those. In the couple of times that I've fought him now. One, two, three. Yeah. God, mm, why am I missing all these timings? I'm just rattled from that Soda Popinski fight. God, that made me so mad, you guys. One, two, three. There we go. And that's how you sneak in the fucking star. Ah! No, Chamomile, I don't masturbate that way. Ah! Hmm. And careful, Scorch, I have uh, nearly kicked my power button multiple times. I actually, my surge protector under here, um, there was a short period of time where it was just at, like, the extension of my leg's reach. And so there were a couple of times where I would stretch my legs out to watch a movie or, or render footage or something and I would accidentally kick the fucking surge protector. And then, boom. And at that point, you're just like, ah! Ah! and everything goes white, and then the next thing you know, you wake up and, and the room is trashed. <coughs> well now, it seems that uh, the terror from Tokyo knows to stay the fuck down. This is not the time you want to get in my goddamn way. I have my sights set squarely on this gentleman. Unfortunately, Piston Hondo is just collateral damage as a formality. Won't you laugh at my fist in your face? Alright, Soda Popinski. Oh, wait for it. Uh, 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 uh. I got a star. I've got a star, you guys. I'm gonna wait to use it. Hopefully I don't fuck it up. I'm gonna fuck it up. I'm not gonna fuck it up! Oh my god, I didn't fuck it up! Ah! First KO at a minute 12. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. He's gonna he's gonna counterattack and then counterattack again. Two, three, four. Low uppercut. Ha 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 Fuck you. Fuck you, big man. Who you think you're fooling with that shit? Who you think you're fooling with that shit? It ain't a little Mac. Oh, God damn it. Okay, maybe maybe just a little bit. Maybe you fool me just a little bit with that. One, two, three, now. Okay. Oh, oh, that was so intense. That was so intense, you guys. Oh, my God. Okay, keep your guard up. After you lose, we'll drink to your health. <laughs> All that, those years of alcohol just ruined his voice, I'd imagine. Or, excuse me, Sody Pop. Yeah, go down like a cheap drunk prom date, baby. Seven seconds. And just like that, he's back up for round two. Also like a cheap prom date. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Ooh, got my timings off. Come on, baby. No. When I say dodge, you say dodge, 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 dodge. Oh fuck! He came in with one last punch. I didn't realize I interrupted his 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 string. All right, we're doing good. One, two, 
three coming in for it. Okay, that's two. He's been down twice. Um, <laughs> I actually didn't get laid for the first time until well after my prom, so uh, yeah. I went to my prom and I had a date, but uh, you know. Military school, what can I say? God damn it, no. I can't, I can't lose a third time to Soto Popinski. I can't do that. One, two, three. Oh, oh, oh no, no! Oh, I'm gonna TKO that son of a bitch! God damn it! Oh, I want his ass so bad. Feed me his ass now. better not be down for a go fuck you fuck you game fucking Mike Tyson's fucking punch out beats me again I couldn't help it I couldn't give myself any help there was no help to be had I tried <clears throat> okay The worst part is, like, Super Macho Man and Mr. Sandman are way harder than this. Okay, maybe not Super Macho Man. Super Macho Man's actually not that bad, all things considered. He has a much less annoying moveset. But Mr. Sandman is awful. Ooh, damn it. I was hoping I might have gotten lucky to sneak in that fucking star again, but I guess not. Whatever, doesn't matter. Yes, I know, the game fucking hates me. I, I don't really care. Uh, no, but the Super Macho Man is. Fuck. Ooh. Every time I sneak in a surprise star, I always shock myself out of being able to do anything with it. Fuck! His timing is just awful. I guess my timing is awful, but his fucking... One, two, three. <sighs> his framings, like the timing in between his moves is just so awful. It takes so much to get used to. go into this one with nearly full health. This is when we go into full on try hard mode, you guys. Like I'm not even playing around anymore. Fuck. We were here to have fun. We're this is not fun anymore. This is about pride and prejudice against Russia. You're gonna attack him immediately. And get a nice six there. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Excellent, excellent, excellent. All right, wait for it. One, two, three. No! Mm. Oh, you're trying cock juggling thunder cunt! No! Not today! Oh. Okay. Round two is almost over. I just gotta not get a hit. He's going to counterattack. And that's the end of the round. The bad news is, already used my heal. Already used my heal and desperately needed it at the time. So, yeah. Sorry, I have Ryan Reynolds on the brain. So, Cock Juggling Thunder Cunt just came to mind.
I really want to go see Deadpool again, speaking of. That movie's fantastic if you haven't seen it yet. No. Like, the worst part is, you know immediately if you fucked up the timing on the dodges. That's the the best and worst part about fighting Soto Poppins. Okay. God damn it. No! No! Ah! I'm gonna snap this fucking controller in half. You guys are going to actually see me have a fucking aneurysm right here live on stream. I'm telling you, it's coming. I can feel it. Rank down to number six. I have to fight this cocksucker again. I'm gonna judo chop him right in the neck, and then I'm never gonna have to fight him again. I'm so glad that you guys are here for this. It's so rare that I actually get angry on stream. I got hit by all fucking three of those. Are you kidding me? I am the worst at this game. Like, I came into this game feeling really good. The first three rounds were awesome. Like, I really just proved myself as a good gamer. And then Soda Popinski happened. No, no, no. Soda Popinski happened just all over my face, neck, and chest. One, two, three. Ah! Trust me. Trust me, Jen. I think his job is very safe. Ha! Ah! Sit back down, ho! Oh, this might be it. He's gonna get up at nine. No, he doesn't. That's it. Okay. All right. All right. All right. All right. All right. God damn it. I'm letting my rage get the best of me. I need to chill out. I need to get into my zone. I need to let's shake it out. Just shake it out. Oh yeah. Yeah, baby. Let go of all that tension. We feel good right now. We're gonna do this, baby. Got my soda pop myself. Ah, a little bit of hair of the dog. Let's fucking do this. Come on, soda pop Inski, 277 pounds. Ha! That's a, that's a high pile of shit, don't you think? And dodge. Oh, fuck. We missed the first dodge. That's always a good sign, right? You get hit by the first punch, so that you remember what that feels like, and you don't get hit by any of the rest of them, right? Right? Is that how that goes? Ooh, that was closer than I wanted. Okay. Come on, baby. Keep on your, keep on your, your pattern. You know what you're doing. Bye, Jam. We'll see you later on. Hopefully, you can drop back by. We'll be playing. For a little while longer, at least. Damn it. He either does the quick, uh, long uppercut or the, the extended hook as the counter when he when he wakes up. And it's hard to tell which one he's going to do. Nope. Ooh, almost got caught there. Mm. You gotta watch and wait. That's the key. That's the trick to this fight. Watching and waiting. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and heal back up because we're at like a quarter fucking health. God bless America. And it's such bullshit too because seriously it takes like four hits in your KO. He, he, he does so much damage and his hits are so erratic and irregular and weirdly timed that you almost can't help but get hit at least a couple of times by him. And it's so quick to just start that steam train rolling. And then before you know it, you're on your back. God damn it. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ooh. Is 
Sit down. Good, I got to use it in that snuck in star. Three. Oh, he rose up at three. Damn it. It's okay, Doug. I too believe I can fly. I believe I can touch the sky. I think about it every night and day. Oh no, no, no. Spread my wings and fly away. Ah. I believe I can soar. You see me running through that open door. I believe I can fly. I believe I can fly. I believe I can fly. Oh yeah, baby. That's what victory feels like. Oh, who knew that all it took was a little bit of music to soothe the savage beast? Whoo! <sighs> okay. Bald bull time. Again. Again. Bald bull. I didn't realize when I undertook this. <laughs> that it was going to be so damn draining. Like, I know that I've done this so many times, but damn. All right. So let's see if I remembered correctly. Or no, it might have been Mr. Sandman who you can't knock out normally. I don't know. Somebody you can't knock out by normal means anymore. Ooh. Damn it. Ugh. God damn it. I keep looking away to look at the chat and getting punched in the fucking face. Oh. oh no. No, this is bad. This is also bad. Popped him right in the belly. Wow. And uppercut. Oh, didn't kill him. I was hoping that uppercut would be enough. Oh, oh, I see. Yep, it is ball bull. It is absolutely ball bull. Wait for it. Ugh. Ah, fucking fuck. Fucking 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 fuck. Am I gonna get TKO'd straight away by ball bull? Like, after that miraculous victory? Look at that saggy ass. That flat, saggy ass. Like, seriously, Bald Bull, do, do some goddamn squats or something. Have some self respect, man. Ooh, that was close. Oh, he was about to counter punch me hard there. Woo! Listen, Mac. Give him a fast uppercut when he's stunned. You don't say. You don't fucking say. Yeah. Jason, it's really easy to talk all that good shit, but uh, in reality, I don't know that I'm gonna do that well against him. Like, Mr. Sandman is rough. Like, you thought Soda Popinski was bad? He is the worst. Nailed it! That's right! Sit down, Ball Bull! Hi, Little Duck. Yes, yes, this is what Little Mac is from. And that's why in Smash Brothers, he builds up a KO meter, and you can actually, you know, knock out people with a, with a knockout punch with a KO uppercut. And he has, like, a dodge counter, and, um... His, his up move is actually the rising uppercut that you use in the regular game. Oh, oh shit. Sorry, I almost didn't get up. Ow. <sighs> and I'm down. I'm down for good now. Son of a bitch. Well, went down to Soda Pop again. Oh, oh. Noted, Marcus. I know you could do it for some people, but I didn't know that uh, you could do it for him, too. No! Really? Again? Son of a bitch. 
Well, ladies and gentlemen, I think this is a pretty good time for me to take a short break. Uh, when we come back, we're going to keep trying in Mike Tyson's Punch-Out. I've got my code that'll take us right back to Piston Honda, and we're going to get to the end of this goddamn thing, whether it kills us. Thank you kindly. So don't go anywhere. We'll be back in just a couple minutes. Enjoy the music in the meantime. Bye.